Good afternoon. It is time. It has been six days. In six days, it, it went by faster than I thought, but I'm still very much missing my best friend. So, today, it's a travel vlog, my friends. But before we go, and my friends pick me up, I got a box. And in this box was something I've waited so long for. The new Echo Dot. Hello. Your device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. Alexa, pause. So that is, I'm super excited and proud. Um, so Alexa, Amazon, me and Sarah have been talking about getting one of those for a long, long time. It's like so up our alley. And then when we dog sat for Katie and Dustin, we used theirs a lot and Sarah was like sold. So we're gonna wait for Black Friday to get them for a good deal. Cause they're not too expensive, but they're pricier, especially because it's the little Echo Dot, but we want the Echo Tower. And uh, they had a promotion where if you were a computer coder and you made an Alexa skill before October 31st and submitted it and it got approved, they'd give you one. So I made an easy, simple running one. It was like, hey Alexa, how much should I run? Um, I didn't want to activate her. So I just got that in the mail, so it's the newest one. And then we, were, we decided that from Sarah's mom for Christmas, we we're going to ask for the tower so we can have awesome music and Amazon Alexa throughout our entire life. So that's what that is. I gotta go to the airport. Vivi, how do you feel about being in the car? <laughs> I gotta be on <laughs> You couldn't stay frowning for long. Alrighty, so Peter is on his way to the airport right now. Oh, I thought Grant was judging me. Face of a judger. No, I'm just kidding. Grant's our biggest fan. Um, and Christina, Grant, and Violet go to Florida tomorrow, so we are going to Target for last minute errands. We gotta pick up some diapers. For all you that don't know, we use cloth diapers for Violet. <laughs> the cloth diapers are not cute on a plane. Christina got glasses today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because she's graduating Because I'm about to be a college graduate in two weeks. Hey, hey. Hey, do it for the vlog. Hey, do it for the vlog. Hey, do it for the vlog. Hey. Did you get that? Yes. Is your mom on the crazy side? <laughs> whoa, you're on the crazy side. Whoa, 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 whoa. MCO, they got the, the Christmas spirit on. I gotta say, I'm a huge fan of MCO. That was quite busy, but they pulled out all these little stops to make it super quick and painless. They didn't, they let everybody keep everything in their bags, their shoes on and everything for security because they had dogs out that were, you know, the strong scented smelling dogs. So, because it got so backed up in security, they are like, all right, get the dogs out. They're just gonna smell you as you go through line and just start walking through. That was so, I didn't take my laptop out, I didn't take out my toiletries that I had in the backpack. I only got a backpack. I got an hour until boarding, so. I think I might grab some food. I'm gonna take a peruse around, see what my options are. They have fancy restaurant looking things back there, but I'm gonna see what kind of quick and painless things they have. Never, uh, I don't think I've ever flown United, so. I got my Chicago vibes on. I have an appreciation for this stand right here. It says Taste of Florida. Key lime cookies, gator droppings, turtle poop, coconut patties, hoodies, the classic saltwater taffy. I can do a little bit of story time real quick. I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna eat. There's not many two options, but there's this little quick service like food court and it reminds me, this is the gate I flew out of when I 
flew down to interview for my previous job, which we didn't really talk about a whole lot, but I used to work at Wyndham, um, Wyndham Timeshare. I was a data analyst for them. And I flew down for my interview, and I was like so hungry because I was too nervous to eat before. And I flew down and flew back up to Chicago all in the same day. So I was starving at the end of my like seven hours in the office doing a bunch of interviews. Didn't even get an answer that day. I got an answer the next day. So I was like frustrated and starving. And I went over here to this Wendy's and I literally feasted like Thanksgiving dinner by myself behind this Machu walk so nobody could see the disgusting state of my dinner. There's my gate, gate 42 United. 822 departure, 742, 745 or something like that. Boarding time, it says it's on time. I got me a little dinner here. I got nature's table, a chicken, a chipotle chicken burrito, a wrap, a little Red Bull action. They got free Wi-Fi, so I'm gonna pull my laptop out rather than kill my cell phone battery. I'm gonna pull the laptop out and watch some YouTube or something to kill this next 40 minutes. Actually, timing worked out perfectly. By the time I finish eating and doing all that, it'll be, uh, it'll be time to board, and it'll be great. I feel like airport, it's running with my Gary Vee fans. I feel like airport Peter right now. I got my my dark cloud Gary Vee 03s. I got my, my Chicago hat. I got my Chicago jacket. Everything's ready. Sarah's ready. Grant's ready. Everybody's ready. I'm ready. Well, let me eat, and then I'll be ready. dinner now. Peter is on an airplane right now. Me and Grant are gonna get him later. I don't know if we've told you guys this, but we decided that I'm no longer driving at night because of my vision. So I'm off to dinner with some friends from high school and I'll bring you along. O'Hare Airport this quiet, but it feels good to be back in this airport. Attention Sarah, oh, it is illegal for Sarah and Grant are like 20 minutes out, I think. I'm gonna check out how the arrivals and departures look. It doesn't look too cold out, but the crew outside are definitely, they said it was ground temperature was 25 or 29. Chicago, I love Chicago. We have a lot of plans downtown this week, so you're gonna hear it a lot from me. So I'm gonna say it now, I'm gonna say it again later. Chicago, best city in the world. Disney World, best place in the world. There is a difference. Same, same, but different. Of course, there's a Starbucks. Well, the departures, but look at these cute little ornaments. Illinois. Illinois, the prairie state. Chicago. Gotta love it. I got time to kill. They're about 15, 20 minutes out. So I'm gonna wander around and look at all the beautiful stuff about my wonderful city. <sighs> all right. Oh, I see my first bit of Chicago Christmas right, right there. First bit 
of Chicago Christmas, a big old wreath. Sarah texted me and said they're coming through the airport now, so they should be here any second. Hey, everybody. Drive, drive away. Go Look, it's Grant. He said, look out for the pat sticker. <laughs> <laughs> Are you just jealous? No. Look, it's it's my, it's me and Sarah Yay. together again. You Thanks for coming to get me, guys. We texted Peter and said, if the traffic is bad, tell us to pick you up in the departures. He said, no, traffic's okay. Just come to the arrivals. I see people flying by to the departures. We would have been home by now <laughs> if we met him at the departures. But I'm glad to see him. Why didn't you heat it up? It's too good to, to wait any longer. Peter was surprised with leftover Bavon. But watch is really good. But I called it. Yeah, we were like, don't. But did you believe me when I said no? No, I never believe you. <laughs> what? So when we said there's something really good waiting for you, he was like, is there babotch? And they're like, no. <laughs> and basically babotch is peppers, onions, sausage, and potatoes. Heaven. Heaven. I'm gonna shut all my layers. I'm here. To this camera. I leave in four and a half hours. It's really not fair. <laughs> it's a holiday time. Grant feels like a Russian oligarch. I'm Zoolander. Ooh. Da, da, da. Your baby's crying. My baby's crying. Baby. Um, it's good to be home. It's good to be home. <laughs> We're back together, finally. This is home right here. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.